Aliyah joins forces with Rotimi Amici. Welcome to the news and thank you for telling me to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. The governor of Benue State, Hyacinth Aliyah, has donated a brand new Lexus LX600 SUV worth 350 million naira to the former River State Governor, Rotimi Amici, in appreciation of the support during the 2023 campaign that brought him to power. According to reliable sources, Governor Leah said the gesture was to show his gratitude to Amici for the huge financial support he gave, he gave to enable him to win the governorship election. The Banner State Governor has told many of his associates and even the all even though the All Progressive Congress gave him the governorship ticket, it was Amici's financial support that made it possible for him to wage a victorious campaign to defeat the incumbent People Democratic Party, PDP, in the state. Amechi, who contested the All Progressive Congress presidential primary and came second behind the eventual winner, President Bola Tenebo, was believed to be sending funds to Aliyah through the then Executive Secretary, Nigerian Shippers Council, NSC, Emmanuel Jaim, who is also from Benue State. It was for that reason that President Tenebo called for ministerial nominations. Governor Lee had made Jaime's main candidate for the Benue ministerial slot. It was a decision of the Amici camp, which Aliyah is a key member, to clandestinely plant ministers in the Tenable administration to perfect the 2027 presidential agenda. Governor Aliyah is in deep talks with some leaders of the PDP for a possible defection, as he is no longer sure of the All Progressive Congress ticket. He and Jaime Amici's right hand man in the North Central region had strategized him for an alternative platform for both the presidential and governorship ambitions of Amici and Aliyah, respectively. To confirm the story, just yesterday, Emmanuel Jaim granted an interview to the news agency of Nigeria, NANA, in which he defended the allegation that Governor Aliyah has recruited some person to speak on his behalf in Asso Rock. Jaim used the opportunity to hit back at the APC stakeholders in Benue, who recently criticized the governor of Aliyah for running the government like a private business. He described the L Progressive Congress stakeholders as people looking for stomach infrastructure. The tragedy of our democratic experiment so far is that most of us see politics as a meal ticket. Whenever an elected official chooses the path to real development, you will have the stomach infrastructure politicians attempting the distraction strategy. Governor Lea himself has not spared his party men, particularly the elders and older stakeholders of harsh words. Only two days ago, the governor came down hard on the Benway APC Zonal Vice Chairman, who had earlier criticized him for not carrying anyone along in decision making. His chief press secretary, Tasso Kula, in a statement said, It was uncharitable of the party stakeholder to expect the governor to always consult them before making appointments and taking other actions. The three man forerunner team further suggests that the governor favors people outside the All Progressive Congress who allegedly worked against him during the lecturing and voting phases. This appears more like petty resentment from the psychotic imagination, lacking any substantive basis. In the coming days, Governor Leah will be holding more talks with some of the People Democratic Party leaders who are promising to give him the party's platform and structures if it defect from APC. Last week, it was reported that the Benue governor held a Zoom meeting with the PDP stalwarts, notably former national chairman of a party, Senator Iachia Ayu, Senator David Mack, and Senator Gabriel Suswam, among others. Well, well, well. First of all, this is my question to Governor Amiya. Where you use see money where you buy moto, where you give Amechi? Yeah. Because I know, say, you never enter. You never reach how many years. You're not even up to one year in power. I don't want to believe that it is your salary or your allowances that gave you 350 million. Hmm. I don't want, like I said, I do not want to believe it. And I'm, I'm, don't get me wrong here. He helped you. He did, he did da, 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 da for you. No problem. But my owners, make sure. They are not using the people of Benue State's money. Benue State people, they don't suffer. They need somebody to come in and stand on their feet and walk 
for the betterment of Benue State. Not somebody who will come in and is not going to, you know, they're not going to be feeling any impact. So where did they get 350 to buy a car for only one man who is already stinking rich? That is corruption. How many youth in your state have you employed? What have you put in your place in your state to elevate poverty and suffering? If you can dole out 350 million naira to an individual as a position, should be investigated and ICPC should be on your trail, corrupt governor. Extremely corrupt, Tinubu. Let's fight from the father of corruption first. A man who forged his university certificate. No, no, I'm not going down with you. I'm not going down that road with you guys, I beg. Nah, not today. Does this cycle read what read what they wrote and Mechi did for him after his nomination by APC? Now mission I sponsor I'm single handed. Like I said, this is not me saying don't appreciate but appreciation with that kind of a gift. People will always work that on why. If now your personal money now no problem. If like carry all your personal money, go buy anything with the buy friend. But make sure, like I said, the people of Benue State they deserve better. They don't chop with they go don't they don't see shaggy. I beg, I beg, I'm begging the governor to leave that evil and blood sucking party called APC and the PDP before it is too late. Please, Mr. Governor, I'm assuming you that the umbrella is big enough to accommodate you. Delay is dangerous. Oh, okay. You won't make him leave APC, enter PDP. Without Governor Leia, APC will be nothing in Benue State. Let him defer to PDP. APC will never get a single seat in Benue in 2027. <laughs> And I think that was the plan. You know, as in go APC, a lot of people are like, why you join APC? You join APC so that single fit enter. But the thing is, if they defect, how will they be? People would always defect from parties for be then join from. We will say another party with the ruling party. How will they always be? Me, I will feel me. If you ask me, I will feel making mellow down small. Okay, the governor is showing sign that he is after himself and politicians who helped him. Spending such amount of money to buy a car for Mechi may, may be, maybe there are.